Kirsty from All Red Lighting once again. I've got to apologise to you firstly. We lost a video of YouTube on our uh, Illustro big, large buried up lighters that a lot of people wanted to see. So I'm going to reintroduce them on this video. A second apology because it is actually 38 degrees here, so it's actually sweltering here in our test test room, but that's a good thing. I'm going to come to our up lights, our buried up lights, and the reason why they've become so uh, this gained a lot of interest on on uh, LinkedIn, etc., and YouTube. It's because of the novel way that they're made. You know uh, the, the phone chargers where you don't connect them. They work on the same principle. They work on induction. The big problem with buried up lights, as a lot of electricians and contractors will, will guarantee and state, they wire their armored in ca uh, cable and do a connection. They're told to dig a soak away so for the water to run off. If you get a, a big uh, flood or a massive thunderstorm, you get water over the top of your buried up lights. There is a chance that you can get differences in heat between the body and the head and it can suck water in or water can climb up the cable and come in the base of the fitting. If water does come in, the breaker blows and the electrician gets a call from the owner of the property or the property manager, can you come and fix my buried up lights? The only way you can do that is to take the head off, clean it all out with a bit of tissue, put the head back on and hope it works without any water inside. So today I'm going to introduce our 9 watt and 18 watt buried up lights, our illustrious range. Firstly, if we have a look at the base, this can be set in concrete. Ignore the cable gland, that's just there to make it look pretty. Actually, this is a, a inside here is a, uh, a total resin filled unit. So when it's resin filled, it's filled up with resin, that sets solid, water can't ingress it. It's a total sealed unit. There's no way water can go into that anywhere. This at the top then has a plastic, what I call locator. This plastic locator has a probe inside. And the head here, what we can see with the head, is again a total sealed unit where the plastic locates inside this. Obviously, when that part goes inside that part, the buried up lighter lights up because it generates its own power in the top, which is very clever. So we'll just demonstrate that. I put that on, the product lights up. I take it off, it's off. I put it on, product lights up. 316L stainless steel, perfectly set in ground, two star keys so they can't be tampered with, now, no soak away. And to show you how confident I am in this product, and I'm not saying it's designed to go underwater, but I have a bucket of water here, and I'm gonna put this base underwater. You've had a big flood. Your up lights are now set in the ground, okay? This is underwater. I put it on, I take it off. I put it on, I take it off. Now, if this is in the ground and there's a flood, there's no way of electrocution to any outside party because there's no arcing, there's no way it can pass any electricity out or get water inside. So we do that again. Now, this solves a massive issue for buried up lights, uh, just per se, as I've mentioned earlier, with electricians getting calls back to sites and having to go and fix problems. A lot of electricians have told me they are stunned by this range. They are absolutely stunned by the fact that they can fit something safely. So if you'd like to know more, contact us at Aurelid Lighting or aurelid.co.uk and we'll tell you more. We'll tell you where to use, we'll give you the photometrics, we'll give you all the data. Five year guarantee, 316L stainless steel, cannot leak. We're not saying it's meant to go in swimming pools, etc. We will use a low voltage version for that, but for areas you need a mains voltage, nice, safe system, this is the unit to use.